good morning and welcome back to the channel. We've uh, moved bins. This morning, uh, I had to knock off a little early last night, had some stuff to do. So I got Craig over here to uh, work about an hour or two for me. And uh, you were switching bins, so the plan was to load everything we had. So the trucks are loaded and got some on the grain cart. And so this morning I've got some trucks to unload before we get to combine and dad's done went to the field and he's uh, servicing the combine, getting everything ready. So let's unload some trucks. <laughs> That was the county we just met on the road. They've got my ditch hay on along my driveway. I can't complain, the county does a good job keeping the driveway clean, they just don't get over the fence. Oh well. So I got both trucks unloaded. Mickey pulled around on the other side and is loading out a semi. I don't know if you can see his trailer there or not. So we're combining corn. I've run back shop to get something. I'm gonna grab some lunch for us to eat in the field. And I'll be back with you soon. Well, they got quite a bit done yesterday or last night. So let's walk over here. We got some down corn right up here. There we go. Let's see what, how good of a job he does getting that up. Kind of a slow go. Well, he bent the hopper extensions up again last night, so uh, next year he's wanting to go to eight row header, so he push them out further away from the trees. They're a lot cheaper just to pay attention. Well, we got cut over to the beans. He's come in hot with a full hopper. Look at that hopper extension. He's warped her up pretty good. A lot of down corn through here.
he finally got the auger about right on on one. He's usually over to one side too far. But this 2388 has longer auger than uh, our previous two, so it's understandable. So we grew a certain variety and number of corn last year that really, really yielded good. Uh, was probably averaging about 230, had some hit about 240 bushel an acre. So we went heavy on it this year. And uh, we've got a lot of spots like this, especially in this field. Uh, we got another field yet that's going to be real slow go because it's all like that. But you can see the ear. it got a good ear just on the ground. It's been a slow go. So what he's done here, he's went inside this. It's an old stump. You should be a tree there. And he's going all the way back to the long groves. So from down here, that way, will be shorter rows but uh it's taking us longer than what i thought because it's just spots like this down spot all out throughout the field i'd like to congratulate mark benton for getting 100 subscribers i think he's got 102 now but uh, if y'all haven't checked him out, Martin Benton, uh, let's see if we can get him 200 subscribers here pretty quick. Well, he's going around the edge of the field, getting in rows that way. And uh, it's not gonna be too much longer. We're gonna have to quit, I believe. But we'll talk to you in a little bit. So I noticed on the last load I dumped in here, I'm getting a little bit dribbling out off the side. And, uh, Trying to back up, not trip. If you can see, the auger has got shifted. I don't know if the tire tire seems fine, but uh, as muddy as it is, as much weight as it is, I'm thinking the auger got shifted this this way. So for right now. I'm just gonna lower that down a little bit, see if that solves it, and uh, probably won't unload too much more tonight in it. It's still dribbling out a little bit. Well, I was getting concerned. I got back to the field from unloading the truck and uh couldn't see him couldn't hear him he was around the corner over there getting some uh rows that you can't see but it's uh cooled off about 20 degrees in the last last 30 minutes uh looking rainy and all of a sudden there's rain in the forecast 70 percent for later tonight and uh it wasn't there earlier today it was like 10 percent so we may be having to cut this short here in just a minute because 
we still got bins and everything else to shut up and the uh, trucks to unload. So we'll just see from there. Well, the plan is, uh, I've had this cart here kind of in overflow. And, uh, I'm going to dump it onto the red truck and go ahead and unload it. And uh, so it'll be empty. I think we're going to take everything in tonight. told me on the CB that uh, we're going to go ahead and quit. We've got some bins to shut up. Uh, we're going to bring combine in, both trucks. By uh, the time we get all that, it'll be after dark. So if you made it this far, thank you and God bless you. Um, if you like it, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, subscribe uh, and comment. Uh, I get some new commenters every time. I, I really like it. So, until then, later, or whatever, we'll talk to you later.